an afternoon snack while scratching in the dirt and enjoying the sunshine. Life is pretty good for Jean Weinberg's chickens. She's been raising them on Gabriola Island for over five years and has loved every minute of it. You can spend hours just sitting watching chickens do their thing. The chickens are happy, healthy. They're just layers. They're not fancy heritage birds or anything, but they're kind of cute. Jean will be sharing her opinion and experiences with chickens during an upcoming event, Tour de Coop. I thought, well, that would be a lot of fun to do on Gabriola because I know, well, just about everybody I work with has chickens, and I know a lot of people who do. But there's quite a few people out there that are considering raising their own birds, but they're just not sure. And um, so they will get information on different ways that you can do it fancy ways or cheap ways. Some people have just a few chickens and some have a bunch of chickens. Uh, some people have ducks. My ducks are Rowan. They're Indian runners and then there are Khaki Campbells. Um, there are crested ducks which have like a little poof on their head. You can see these poofy headed ducks also on the tour. Connor Madison has raised them since they were just days old. They grew up uh, to be big enough to lay eggs. We can sell the eggs, we can eat the eggs, and they're really tasty. Wonderful, beautiful, healthy eggs, but also they clean up the garden. In the winter, I let them into the vegetable garden, and they clean out the weeds and all that sort of thing. They provide compost, and they provide entertainment. They're hilarious, they're fun, and anybody who has chickens will tell you that, or duck. They are just hilarious. Like. Ducks are funny. Each of our ducks are unique. We named our ducks. They're kind of funny. And uh, my duck is named Professor Beaker. My brother's duck, which he picked out, has like a big poof. And we've like been calling them different stuff like toque, poutine, and all those random names because we can't come up with a name for him. He's just so hilarious. Maybe this duck will get named on the tour. Yeah, maybe someone maybe. will have a name suggestion. Yeah. What should your name be? Connor came up with an idea to turn the tour to coop into a fundraiser for the Free the Children group Adopt a Village project in Africa. The money raised for the tour will go towards the purchase of baby chicks to be raised by local villagers. I think that'll be pretty good because then once they grow up, they'll lay eggs for them. They can produce food and you can sell the food so and sell the eggs like my mom does. So it's a perfect idea, like r getting a whole bunch of chickens, helping people who don't have the needs to help themselves is awesome because how can we say that this world is awesome and great if some people don't have the needs to live? It really is a huge source of income for people in a country like Sierra Leone, so that's what the money is for. And a few dollars from here will go a long ways for buying chickens in Sierra Leone. There will be 12 different coops to visit on the tour, taking place on Gabriola Island on June 15th. More information can be found online. On Gabriola Island, I'm Kelly Robinson. Kisses for everyone. <laughs>